So once again, we've reached the point where I don't have enough lighting in my room. Nice. And we got Tapabulu nice and caught. Mm. Yeah, I'll leave Woody at the front. I don't think it's a good idea, but I'm going to do it. Let's see what's good. I want to know what's wrong with this chick. Freaking, she's dying on us or something. New Age, thank you once again for coming. Okay. I've been waiting for you, New Age. Once again, we have already gathered the intel on the UB we are targeting. Mr. Nanu provided us with everything that we need to know. The UB has been sighted on this island. It is known by the codename Blade. It's a fearsome beast that is apparently able to cut through anything at all. Oh, and it's not a single sighting either. UB04? Blade, Blade Faller? Blade Feller? Is my laptop dead? We cannot afford any delays. I will protect the populated areas as usual. Okay. New Age will go to the site. Mr. Looker, you will stand by. We will ask you to handle the backup. <laughs> Are you alright, Chief? I think you're pushing yourself too far. If you would agree, I'd be happy to go into the field myself this time and... I'm fine. I can handle this. I have you to watch my back after all, don't I? Yes, ma'am. Then I'll be off now. New Age, I wish you fortune in battle. Dang. Don't push yourself too hard, Chief. Please, be careful. Hey, there's that music, though. All right, I know the drill. Beast balls, got him. And then we go catch us a Perka Man. Let's get him out of the mind. Uh, analyze the UBU con if you wish to learn more. The usual gotcha. Let's get him. All right. We know the drill. Yeah, you know, what is going on here? There's just like a trail of trainers. All right, we'll get to that later. We got some Pokemon to catch. Is it Kartana? Oh, it is. Ooh. I've never seen it all animated and such. Attack rose sharply of freaking course. Alright. So, Kartana, what level are you? 60? What attacks do you have? Air Slash, Detect, X Scissor, and Leaf Blade. So, not really much, but also, like how I was talking about earlier. Pokemon having the weird catch rates or the UBs having the weird catch rates this guy apparently has like guaranteed catch rate I don't know what's up with that this one might have been good for the level ball too hmm what colors are this white hmm do I want to catch it with a repeat ball that seems like a good one, right? Kind of want to just try chucking a ball at it, see what happens. Or a fast ball. This is a fast Pokemon. Whatever, let's go for it. Let's test out this capture rate. Okay. That broke out right away. <laughs> so he goes for a detect. That's cool. Uh... Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna be keeping track of the moves. I've become like a professional at this or something. I don't know. Maybe. You know what? I'm gonna go with the repeat ball. Let's do it. Ooh, I like the arrows. That's cool. Okay, maybe that's not your catch rate. I don't know. I don't mean to judge. Damn, that did a lot. His attack is pretty high. And now it's even higher. Okay. Okay. So he's already at plus three attack. That's no fun. Let's go out in a Wingo. So he's used one Leaf Blade, one Detect. He also has the random Air Slash. 
for, you know, just in case. But we are catching this thing. Just up in the difficulty every time. Until we get him. We're professionals. Wingo, you're dead. I'm sorry. I didn't mean for that to happen. I need to, like, adjust. There you go. There's cords all over the place. All right. Let's go out into Kyo. And see... No one's living a hit. There's there's no there's no living here. We just throw in balls until we're good to go. Now the only difference between Kartana and Circuitry is Kartana has a lot more attacking moves. Kind of. I guess once Leaf Blade and X Scissor are gone, we'll be good to go. But the only problem with that is they have fifteen of both. So we can't exactly stall him out like we could, uh, Zerkatry. I mean, we can, it's just gonna take forever. Granted, I'd edit that out so you guys wouldn't see it. It'd just take forever on my part. And after that, I don't have many chances to catch it. Wow. I should have just given everyone a Focus Sash. Because these Pokemon are living like Larry. <laughs> living like crazy. I mean, dying like crazy. I completely said that wrong. Anyways. Oh, I think I did this wrong too. I was supposed to start healing them now. Whoops. So he's going to Leaf Blade now. And... Here's where I get to the part where I try and stall him out of all of his moves, and we see what happens. Okay, he went for Detect that time for whatever reason. He's a little scared of the Solgaleo. Hey! He's a lot of scared of the Solgaleo. Not even bad. That was easy. Easy peasy. Hey, we got us a Kartana. Nice. Getting all kinds of Pokemon. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Apparently, this thing is really small. It's like... A foot tall. But we're gonna send this thing to the box. Hey! We got us a character. Three? What? Why are there three more to catch still? That's okay. That's just experience for me, friends. That's okay, munchies. We we don't got the quick claw for nothing. Am I right, boy? Yeah. Let them know. Get out of here. Wow, we didn't get that much experience. But we got enough to level up Keo and Woody. Let's see what happens if we just chuck a beast ball. That's what I'm saying. These beast balls are hella overpowered. Like a master ball. It's a wrap. Stay in that ball. Hey. Damn. That one got even more messed up than the other ones. Wingo is at level 50. Hydro Pump. Water Pulse? Let's get some power, Wingo. Let's get some power. Alright, Looker. Mission is a done. I'm pretty sure. Ah! Done it. Amazing. Bravo. Now what? Is the world safe once again? We also didn't have to go to that second location, so that was interesting. I wonder if all of them are like that when they're in multiple locations. You could just get it at the one? Maybe. I finished sending the data from the UBU protected to HQ and to Miss Wiki as well. Thank you for your hard work, New Age. 
You should learn everything there is to know about Cartana, also known as Yubi Blade. Yubi Blade. And we also had word from HQ. There's only one Yubi left for us to take care of. Oh, nice. And we had our hands full with so many individuals for this last Yubi. It was a rather dangerous situation. But you were alright, Chief? Yes, of course. Both me and my Pokemon were fine. Of course, we ran into some difficult situations. Being surrounded by the UBs and outflanked by them made it rather tough for a while. As I feared. <laughs> what is it, Mr. Looker? You have been acting rather odd for a while now, haven't you? Ah, uh, no. It's nothing. Hmm. Could it be? Could it be about our long-delayed feast? Oh! <laughs> yes, yes indeed! What a disaster that you have found me out! That's true, I'm starving, just starving. How a Snorlax feels, I know exactly now. He. How hopeless you are, Mr. Looker. But I suppose we have been putting it off for a rather long time. You must be hungry indeed. Then allow me to take point this time and find a delicious restaurant for us all. Ah, yes, ma'am. Thank you, ma'am. There we go. It's a bit embarrassing to admit, but I'm actually quite famished myself. You two stay here and relax while I go and find us a place to eat. Oh, she's going to be like, Un disaster! The chief can't take much more of this. She must be exhausted. She acts particularly cheery when she's feeling unwell to hide her weakness from others. I know it may be a bit late for this, but there's something I'd like to tell you. It's something that happened about ten years ago now. I came to the Alola region at the time as part of a three-person team to eradicate a UB. Of course, we did not know them as UBs back then. It was simply a dangerous creature. My team succeeded in chasing down the UB, and then we tried to put an end to it. But somebody screwed up. Nanu! <laughs> Nanu. This half-hearted fool here felt sorry for the monster, even if only for a moment. That moment was enough to get the third member of our team done in by the UB. Oh, dang. This I cannot deny. I made an error of judgment. I failed to consider the fact that she was not trained for combat. She was just bait for the UB. And the international police knew it. The UBs relentlessly seek out those who have passed through an ultra wormhole. The passage must change them somehow, as though they've been bathed in some energy, something that the beasts can smell or sense. It is though the UBs could track such people as through sniffing them out. It's not like the monsters come here by choice. They don't want to be here. So they smell that familiar scent and think there'll be a wormhole, that they'll get home. Nanu. You called her bait. She really was, wasn't she? Father? Oh. Uh, that is what the international police calls them. Humans who appear from an ultra wormhole. And those who are bathed in a great deal of energy that pours out from them. She had come through a wormhole. She was from another world. And she was put on our team to help draw the UBs to us. Oh, dang. And now you're repeating history. You've got to follow right here, haven't you? That's right, boy. I'm talking about you. Oh, dang. Yes, it's true. He passed through an ultra wormhole. New Age was exposed to the energy, so he may indeed be a faller. But... I'm back. Oh. <laughs> I'm sorry, young New Age, but let us continue this talk another time. I'm sorry, you two. I couldn't get a reservation at the restaurant. It seems like it's a very popular place. I feel like this has like tied on my head. Okay. That works. Hey, Missy. Mr. Nanu, I didn't realize you were here. Another one of those monsters appeared, this time on Pony Island. I'll tell you more when you get there. We'll meet at the floating restaurant in Seafolk Village. This next one seems like a real tough opponent. Be sure you're ready for it. Uh-huh. Uh <laughs> oh, yes, of course we will. Thank you again, Mr. Nanu. 
the last you be? Who's it gonna be? Ha! Um, Mr. Looker, is everything alright? Of course, it's fine. Not a problem at all. Then I will make my way to the floating restaurant at Pony Island. Once you're ready, New Age, please do come and join us there. So it's on to Pony next. I'll be counting on you, New Age. Yeah, we said that like four times. Floating restaurant. Got it. Let's go then. <laughs>